All right, I beat Ethan to the chat. Yo, let me do it again. Not done yet, I just started. Not done yet. All right, we're gonna get started because we gotta get be done by nine because Paul is going live for our Facebook break. So, break number two: Onyx Vintage Football. This was a pick the player break, so everybody should know who they have. I'm not gonna go down that monstrous list, but if you forgot, I will take a look. Good luck, everybody. Stephen opened two personal cases of this, so he's gotten to play with some Onyx. I have not. If you haven't seen Onyx, oh my goodness, you saw it right in your face there. Hold on. These boxes are little, and they're sliding everywhere. All right, give me one second. We'll fix this. If you haven't seen Onyx, here it is, right in your face. As Corey calls them, they look like little razor, like what your razor blades would come in. going to stack two rows. All right, 48 autos, 24 boxes. <laughs> Here we go. Pretty neat little boxes. I don't really like how they pack them, but somebody was telling me they ship in these boxes, so maybe we'll try that. Alright, pack number one. Get two base, two autos. We'll start with Kadarius Tony and Jalen Mayfield. Our first auto. Zaven Collins. So the blue ink is your common, number to 400 or less. And boom, right out of the gate, Mr. Ross on the board with an Eli Manning. So the vets in this are Eli and Justin Herbert. I think that was the only two they had. Only two vets. The rest are all rookies. Oh, Eli Manning. So... Blue, number to 400, green to 50, red, 25, black to 5, and it's all based on the color ink. That's pretty sharp. I, like, I love the vintage design. We'll have some vintage baseball coming out here pretty soon, too. 
tell you what, Onyx does a pretty decent job with their products. For being a small company that doesn't do a ton of releases, I'm a fan. Only I don't like is how they pack. Of course, the packs were clear in baseball. At least these are foil. Kind of help hide the cards a lot more. Alright, we got Dylan Moses and Thomas Graham Jr. Our autos. We have a redemption for Mr. Kyle Pitts. So these work a little bit like Leaf. You don't know what parallel you're going to get. And the difference between Leaf is you have to mail these in. Next up. Black Ink. Liam Eichenberg. Black Ink. Number to five. How about that? Out of the gate. Eli Manning and Eichenberg. Auto number to five. Well, there are some that are hand numbered, not number to five, but print run of five, I should say. So far, these look pretty good. Now, I do know when we did the um, the Onyx Nimbus baseball, which was a foil card, some of those were a little dinged up. I think a lot of it has to do with you got to be kind of careful getting them out of the box. But I haven't noticed any corner damage on any of them yet but that is a good point that that does happen with these and I think it's more or less the way they have the patch the boxes are fine no issue there but to get them out of here you end up kind of to me the best way is to take them out this way because otherwise the pack can get a little dinged up you can also buy your wife a necklace in a box like this so far, so good on the corners. I'm saying that's my only gripe about Onyx is I'm not a huge fan of the way they package their stuff. And I don't know a better way, but it has to be a little bit better way. Right, got an Elijah Moore, last player taken, going to Marshall and Devonta Smith. First auto. Jamie Newman and Elijah Mitchell, the other Elijah, both blue ink variety. Yeah, no, I mean, they are cardboard, like a vintage stock, so they definitely could kind of be easily dinged up. They're not like chrome. So far, I'm not seeing anything major. Uh, corner. Now, of course, they're all on card autos too, so you know, the players handled them and their agents handled them and their girlfriends handled them. And... So you're on the road. Where are you going tonight? You're going to make it a two day drive? It's only Wednesday, right? Yeah, it's only Wednesday. <laughs> It'll take you two days to get across that bridge, though, probably, right? I think Jamie, or I think Newman was a pretty good sleeper. He was a really highly counted quarterback that transferred to Georgia and decided to sit out. 3K for life. I was telling him, Corey, I like the product. I don't like the way they package this thing. If you missed it, Corey, we got an Eli Manning out of the gate. That was pretty cool. Don't crash if you're driving and watching. Connor Weddington and JC Horn. That was a little off center. And our next auto, Marlon Tuipoloto. Tulutu. Tuipoloto. And Red Ink, Curtis Robinson. So your Red Ink is numbered to 25. Also got a red and a black ink already, too. Cards look great. I love the, the feel. They even feel vintage. It's funny when the UPS guy brought me the cases today. They're in a 
I guess, still packed in the original Onyx case, and it has the sticker on the outside of the Master case. And uh, he's like, "Oh, these are vintage." <laughs> Very nice. We got a blue, blues, and we got a red, and we got a black. There are inscription autos, and some of those are hand numbered. We haven't got one of those. Yet. There you go, Tim. I'm firing it up for you, being being kinder to you than we had been. Now the reason I so Stephen came by last night, and picked up two cases. I had three at the time, and I kept this one because it had a dent on the box, and I was like, you know what? I bet that's a lucky case. We'll see if it keeps up. Shuba Hubbard and Hunter Long for our next auto. Boom. Trey Lance. Very nice. And another green ink, our first green ink, Dem Demondre Lenore. So we'll sleeve up Mr. Lance. Appreciate you guys coming through and taking up the four guys that cord had to drop this morning I know he was like oh these are vintage oh uh, it's just I'll show you it's just the way the inside of the box is designed in our green ink green number to 50 I'll show you it was just the flap that's on the inside of the box I think is what you saw Now there are Trevor Lawrence memorabilia redemptions. If we hit one, we'll random it to everybody. From what we understand, there's only 10 of them across the entire print run, so we figured that's not enough to sell a spot for. I think you were talking about this looks like a coin. Is that what you're talking about? It's a very interestingly designed packing system. I'm hoping that's what you were talking about. If not, I'll go back and look. <laughs> Eli Manning. Brandon Smith. Next auto. Wow, there's an inscription. How about Najee Harris, 2020 National Champs? I'm a tad bit jealous of that one. And Trey Hill, Green Ink. So it's not hand numbered, but it is inscribed. That is darn sharp. I know, I tagged you. I originally tagged you in Hey, They're Open, but it was so early in the morning. I was like, I know he's not up yet. So I just let people grab them. We'll do some more of this. We've got, uh, if y'all like the format, I mean, that is, as an Alabama fan, I'm a little bit jelly of that one. Um, and we had a green Trey Hill. It's a 50. Um, if you like the format, we can do it again. It's a pain to keep up the list, but I don't mind doing it if y'all are, long as y'all are patient with me. And it would help tremendously if you put their first name because I had an alphabetical order by the first name. And I couldn't find everybody. Alright, got an ETN request. Ah. Well, <laughs> there's bad corners on that pack. That one is my fault. Yeah, we may have, somebody brought up Alabama football tickets in the last break. We may have to do some sort of giveaway. Diami Brown. Levi Ozarike. Next up. Mm, there's a nice one. Terrence Marshall. And Rashad Bateman. Dude, nice receivers in that one. Man, these cards look good. They do plan to do a premium version. Uh, the design looks different. I don't know if y'all saw. There were some pictures of those in the, the pictures I posted. So where the players had signed them, they had signed all of them. So I think later this summer. 
Yeah, Steven's on vacation. I think I don't think he sold any, so he still got them. That was a good little wide receiver pack there. It, it's not well. It's kind of like the baseball. It's a foil looking. I'll see. I'll post a picture out in the group. I don't think they've officially announced it yet, but some of the photos have leaked. I think it's just called a premium football. But it's it's not really chrome chrome, but it's got a foil finish to it, like the Nimbus baseball did. That inscription was not numbered. I've, I've watched some breaks. Not every inscription is numbered for some reason. Some are and some aren't. Uh, you got Herbert and you got Eli, I know. Yeah, see so that one. Some of them are hand numbered on the back and some aren't. That one is not. I noticed that in some of the other breaks I watched. Not every inscription is numbered for some reason. We got Hunter Long and Amari Rogers. Next auto, Connor Weddington, and Hunter Long. Yeah, I've noticed it's not it's not even like every other one. There were a lot not numbered, and the ones that were numbered were that I've seen were like high numbered, like to thirty five to forty five. It just probably means that players forgot to do it if they were supposed to number them themselves. Be my guess. And they're not case hits in football. I've seen some cases that had like five inscription autos. Steven had several in his cases he opened. So they're not nearly as rare as they were in the baseball. Our last Onyx baseball case is tonight. And that's the Nimbus, that's the foil. Zavin Collins and Hamza Nisoldi. I'm butchering that name. Then we've got a redemption for Dylan Moses. I saw the white, I wonder what that was. Yeah, the ones I've seen have been numbered much higher, like to 35. Not to say there's not low numbered ones, but I've seen some numbered high. And Quitty Pay. Yeah, the baseball ones were really low. Apparently, the football guys signed more, I guess. Or maybe some of the guys signed inscriptions when they weren't supposed to. You know, you never know if they follow the directions. Like it may have said, sign 10 with inscriptions and number them, and they signed 50. <laughs> you never know. Yeah, so far, JP, I'm, I'm pretty. So far, the conditions have been fine. I haven't seen any major damage to anything. Yeah, I watched the Beard Brothers do a full case, and they had a lot of inscriptions. And I think only one of them was numbered. Elijah Molden, Kyle Pitts, Rashawn Slater, and Brandon Smith. Slater, is that the uh, is that your guy Harper? I think Slater. Isn't he the one that went to the Chargers? Yeah, so far they've been, I mean, I'm not saying they're perfect. As you can see, that top corner is not Jim Mint, but not too bad. <laughs> and I will say that, I will, will say also the penmanship of this year's draft class. You don't see a lot of initials. Most of these guys have pretty decent signatures from what we've seen so far. I noticed that in score, too. Last couple of years, you had so many guys that just you know, signed their initials, or I had had some cases where I've seen guys just print their name. Oh, I can't get it out. Get out of there. Hmm. 
<laughs> but you're right, most of these guys didn't go to school for an education. They went to school to get dressed. Jalen Phillips, Curtis Robinson, Jared Goldwire, and Kylan Hill. Some of these are in their uh, Senior Bowl or All-American jerseys, like that. these two, I think. <laughs> oh, I know, that's terrible. Yeah, I don't, I don't mind the small box. And I don't, I don't have a fix for them, so I don't know what the best way to do it is. I think I liked it when they used the smaller boxes. Remember when they, the first baseball were in really tiny boxes? I think I like that better, but it's hard to say. It's hard for me to critique when I really don't have a fix. I don't know how the best way to do it is. But I like the design on the box. It's pretty, it's old school. I like it. I think they did a good job with it. I think they did a good job with baseball. And dealing with Lance, who's the owner of Onyx, is also a pleasure, so that's even better. I've heard nothing but good things about him. He listens, he looks for recommendations, ideas. All right, let's find an end note on him. All right, we got Cole Van Lannon. It's a hoss. Brandon Smith. Thomas Graham. And Jalen Mayfield. We're going to little a streak of non-numbered autos. I mean, non-colored ink. We need to find some colored ink. Yeah, I think on average, I would say... Just like the Nimbus, I don't think that any of these cards are going to grade well, but as far as, oh, it's terrible. It's also just brutal. <laughs> I can't imagine doing anything bigger than we do with, with this break in like racing. All right, we got what? One, two, three, four, five, six, three, 12 to go. We are halfway. The Devonta. I already got a Najee. I'll be I'll be super good. I do have a Devonta Smith on the way that I pulled out of a break. Tylen Wallace, Greg Newsom of the second. There is my favorite player, Amon Ra, St. Brown, and Chuba. I was kind of hoping the Falcons would take old Chuba Hubbard. They did not. They did not draft any running backs that I'm aware of. May have signed some on the free agent, but on the board. Put it on the board. All right, for guys that were in both score and this, which product do you like better? Two very different products, mind you. But do you like score? With lots of bass and stuff, or do you like Onyx with limited? One is also licensed, so they're obviously. Yeah, looking forward to basketball, especially with the vets being able to get the sign. Javonta Williams, another guy I really like in the running back position. Justin Fields. Trey Hill, we've seen him already, and Cade Johnson. I will go back and probably penny sleeve every card we pull, but I'll go ahead and top load Mr. Fields. Yeah, it's hard not to. If they, if this was licensed, of course, it would be. But I think it's just as nice, if not nicer than some of the Leaf stuff, and I really enjoy opening the Leaf stuff, too. I think Leaf Metal Football is next Friday. I 
I mean, that's true. You got a lot more autographs. And it's only 76 player checklist where <laughs> so it's limited but score is a 400 player checklist or maybe 500 400 i think and there's 386 different autograph subjects and score all right we got jared goldwire and Rondell Moore, another good receiver there. Tylen Wallace, he's a Raven. And there you go, sir, and it's green ink on top of that. All right, Tim, we're going we're gonna to have to change our... We've changed the luck for you last few breaks. We've done much better for you. And a green ink Devonta Smith. Oh, really? A lot of lines? I haven't watched the full case. I've, I watched some of Mike's today. I think I watched his first four boxer and then we did our two boxer. That's all I've watched so far. <laughs> yeah, don't... <laughs> it may not be the product's fault. It may be my fault. Don't blame the product. Blame the breaker. Devonta Smith, green ink. That would be number 250 or less. Roll, tie, roll. Now y'all got me. I was just wondering. So I've got four tickets, right, to the Alabama game. So if, if there's a big game, let's say, I don't know, I haven't looked at the home schedule yet, Auburn, LSU, something like that, if we did a contest and somebody got to go to the game with us, I mean, maybe we even get a hotel room for you. I just wonder if whoever won would really come. I don't know how far. You know, some of you guys live far away. There's our first Zach Wilson. Wow. I'll tell you what, we've pulled a lot of Lions stuff in uh, Chronicles, too. It's been Lions heavy. Zach Wilson. Redemption for Jeremiah Awusu, Kremen, uh, Awusu Koromoa. And Otis Anderson, Jr. Um, I'll give it a closer inspection when we get done. Nothing that I noticed offhand. Redemption for Jeremiah Awosu Koromoa. Notre Dame, I believe. All right, we got eight to go. Let me sleeve up Mr. Wilson. I like their little rookie logo too. I'm glad Onyx decided. All right, we may we're going to come up with an idea. Um, we may have to do some consolation prize if the person can't do it, but we also will do it far enough and out far enough out where people can make plans. I mean, we could definitely, you know, part of the package could be a hotel room. That's not. A, May not be in Tuscaloosa, but we'll, we can get one in Birmingham, which is just 45 minutes away. Um, now you got me brainstorming. That'll be a fun idea. Go to the Alabama game with three kings. <laughs> like I said, I already promised Joe Kerr. He has already said he was coming down for a game. <laughs> oh, you would have a blast. You would have a blast. Wilson and Lenore. Curtis Robinson. Rondell Moore. There's a nice name. The only, I mean, the packaging I don't like. The only other negative of this is they didn't, they weren't able to get Trevor Lawrence. And my understanding is they had a deal with him. And at the last minute, he basically decided he wanted different terms. And the owner said, he can kick rocks. Well, the deal is you only get one ticket. Well, because the other three of us want to go, I'm sure. <laughs> we'll figure it out, though. We'll work out the details. Because that wouldn't be any good, you're right, if you wouldn't want to come by yourself. So, I don't know. We'll figure that out. Because I only have four. Now, I have a buddy that has two right next to mine. 
so we could make maybe work out something. I didn't catch that. No chase in here either. I didn't hear a story behind Chase though. Um, but I did hear the tail behind. Trevor. Or not the details, but some of it anyway. Diami Brown and Pat Fryermuth. And there's a inscription. Hamza Nazardine, Nazaldine, Go Knowles. Maybe that will be numbered. And Penny Sewell. That was a good one. No, nope, this one's not numbered either. So two inscriptions, no numbering on them yet. But the inscriptions are pretty cool. And Penny Sewell. My new favorite Italian dish. I'll have the Penne Sewell with a nice Chianti. Yeah, we'll definitely work out the details. Now I'm excited about that. I wonder if we play Arkansas at home. We might can even convince Corey to come down and hang out with us too. Yeah, I think full case is definitely the way to go. Terrence Marshall. Jalen Mayfield, Robert Hainsey, and there's another nice one, Patrick Sertain. There's a lot of crimson in this product. That is no doubt. A lot of crimson. Of course, they had like 65 draft picks. I'll do that too. I've never been to Kentucky for a game, so heck, I'll come go to any game. It doesn't have to be an Alabama game. All right, five to go. Ten autographs left. <laughs> that is true. I will say, um, I watched the break the other night, and there were two Trey Lance autos in the same pack. <laughs> And one of them was a green ink, and one of them was a blue ink. We need another big QB. We need one more big QB. Or we need a Travis Etienne or, or a Ethan May drive down here just to kick my butt. Dylan Moses and Quiddy Pay. Damonte Coxie. And Pat Firemuth. I think he's a stealer, if I remember right. I have a couple duplicates, but I tell you what, because the checklist is 79 players, the baseball is like 49, you have a lot more duplicates than the baseball breaks. Alright, four to go. Yeah, I had Waddle in a half case break that night, and I had watched the first half, and it was not a Waddle. So I bought him in the second half, and did not... I might have got a base, but it's not getting auto. But check out Breaking Mania and us on eBay. We're doing some more this Saturday night. Corey's doing some Monday night, I believe. Jamar Jefferson and Racy McMath. I think that's a great name, McMath. Next auto, Cole Van Lannan, and Amari Rogers. Did you get Rogers, Ethan? That's a Clemson fellow, right? Or did somebody beat you to him? We've got quite a few more, so between Corey and I, we'll be breaking this for quite some time. Oh, I didn't mean to rub it in. I like the 
see a Mac Jones or a Zach Wilson. Justin Fields. We need one more, at least one more big QB. Cameron Sample. Now Trey Lance Base. Elijah Moore. There you go. Got one for Marshall. And Amon Ra St. Brown in the green. Number to 50. I don't know who drafted Amon Ra St. Brown, but I'm pretty much he's my favorite player. I figure I, when I hear his name, I picture. Um, oh shoot, what's his name? Ah, I can't remember it now. The Mummy movie. The actor that starred in the Mummy movie. Alright, four autos to go. Dwayne Eskridge, Thomas Graham, come on big name, Greg Newsom the second, and Patrick Jones the second. We got a couple seconds. That would make four. <laughs> there are some weird names, but then you got Patrick and Greg, so that's two. Y'all need to watch that Key and Peel skit. If you have not watched it, where they talk about like the, they basically making fun of. They do a like a introducing the team for the West, and oh, it's it's hilarious. Coral D shower handle, and then there's one version where they actually have some guys with, like haha ha, Clinton Dix guest stars haha ha, Clinton Dix. All right, last box. Come on, big one. Uh, you have to tell me their name. I don't remember. <laughs> Possibly. <laughs> Very possible. We're going to do a recap in just one second after we go through our last pack. And I'll probably just recap the odd. Well, we could flip through the base, I guess. Alright, last one. We haven't had any numbered cards. And number cards. There's Patrick Jones again. And Travis Etienne. Alright, we've had a couple packs with the base. And um, the auto was of the same guy. So there's hope. There's hope, Ethan. I think there was a Trey Smith. I don't remember a Bolton. But I will go back through in just a second. There's an Elijah Molden in our last auto of the break. Elijah Mitchell Red Ink. Number two twenty-five. Red number two twenty-five. All right, let's do a recap. We had a Bolton base, but I don't think we had a Bolton auto. But I have a Bolton auto. I pulled out of a score box open, so you may be getting a gift. Alright, one second. We're going to flip through the base real quick. I will go back and sleeve these up most definitely. But here is the base. We've got Patrick Jones, Dwayne Eskridge, Thomas Graham, Cameron Sample, Racy McMath, Jamar Jefferson, Dylan Moses, Pay, Terrence Marshall, Jalen Mayfield, Dami Brown, Pat Fryermuth, Marco Wilson, Demondre Lenore, Kalen Hill, Jared Goldwire, Rondell Moore, Javante Williams, Tylen Wallace, Greg Newsom, Cole Van Landon, Brandon Smith, Jalen Phillips, Curtis Robinson, Elijah Molden, Kyle Pitts, Zavin Collins, Hems and Nazaldine, Mari Rogers, Hunter Long, Downey Brown, Levi Ozurike, Eli Manning, Brandon Smith, Chuba Hubbard, Hunter Long, Connor Weddington, J.C. Horn, Elijah Moore, Devonta Smith, Dylan Moses, Thomas Graham, Jared Mayfield, and Kadarius Tony. 
couple others that I already top loaded. We had Travis Etienne, Trey Lance, Zach Wilson, and Justin Fields. Now, autographs. These are blue ink. So these will be your base autos, number to 400-ish. We had Elijah Molden, Greg Newsom, Patrick Jones, Elijah Moore, Mari Rogers, Cole Van Lannan, Pat Fryermuth, Damonte Coxie, Robert Hainsey, Patrick Sertan, Pene Sewell, Curtis Robinson, Rondell Moore. We had a redemption for Jeremiah Owusu Koromoa. Koromoa. Otis Anderson Jr. Oh, it's in the wrong pile. Tylen Wallace. Trey Hill. Not the Trey you're looking for, I don't think. But there's maybe it was. Trey Hill. Kay Johnson. Amon Ra St. Brown. Chuba Hubbard. Jalen Mayfield. Thomas Graham. Kalen Hill. Kylan Hill, excuse me. Three for three, not bad. Jared Goldwire, Rashawn Slater, Brandon Smith, Redemption 4, Dylan Moses. Uh, what I noted earlier is you have to mail these in, old school style. Quiddy Pay, Hunter Long. Connor Weddington, Rashad Bateman, Terrence Marshall, Trey Lance, Marlon Tui Pulotu, Elijah Mitchell, Jamie Newman, Redemption for Kyle Pitts, Eli Manning, man, he's got nice penmanship, and Zavin Collins. Then we had our parallels, which are based on the ink color. We had a Devonta Smith Green, number to 50, Elijah Mitchell, number to 25. When I say number to 25, they are not numbered, but there's a little grid on the back. Amon Ra St. Brown, Green, number to 50. There's a, these are just inscription autos. I don't know how rare they are. They're not, these are not numbered. There are some hand numbered ones. We had Hamza Nazaruddin, Go Knowles. We had a green Trey Hill to 50. We had a really sick Najee Harris 2020 National Champs inscription. Not hand numbered. Diamor, 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 Diamore, 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 Lenore. Green ink to 50. Curtis Robinson red to 25. We had a black ink. Liam Eichenberg. Those. Oh, that one is head numbered. There you go. I missed that earlier. Four or five. It says number to five, but that one is hand numbered. Four of five on the Liam Eichenberg. That'll do it. We will definitely have more. We got one on eBay for Saturday night if you are so inclined to bid there. But we do have, not a lie, we have 12 more cases sitting over here beside me. So, and I know Corey's got about the exact same amount. So be on the lookout for Breaking Mania, Hawks Breaks, and Three Kings to, to do a good bit of Onyx. I hope y'all enjoyed it. Uh, thank you so much for filling it up. Y'all have, I don't talk again. Like I said, I'll be out of town Saturday. If we don't, you know, I'm sure I'll have something going on in the group. But if we don't talk to you soon, we'll holler at you when I get back. Thanks, guys.